Hey, hey, today I want to talk to you about TubeBuddy, and this is a browser extension you can install that will let you do all kinds of cool things with your YouTube videos. So basically you install it for free, and I'm just setting this up as though I have never done this before, and basically just go to their website and hit Add to Chrome, or whatever browser you're in. Uh, I do think they have a Firefox extension, or a Firefox plugin as well, and I believe they have one for Safari, but in any case, just use Chrome, because at least for now. Um, there's so many other browsers coming up, you know, that you could end up using a different browser as well. But basically, you'll download the extension and then it will get installed and added into your Chrome browser. And then you'll be able to run it as you do any other extension. It will show up up in the upper right here with your details. So, what you'll do, uh, obviously, just go through the sign up um, and you'll go ahead and sign in to TubeBuddy here. So we're going to go ahead and sign in with Google because basically what you want to do is use this for uh, monitoring your account. Now, of course, if you haven't read and agreed to the terms and conditions, it's going to have you agree to the terms and conditions. And of course, you want to read these thoroughly like you do on every website you ever go to. Read the privacy policy and read the terms of use. They're only ridiculously long. But of course, you'll want to do that uh, because you'll want to know all of this information um, and make sure that you're okay with all of it when you check the terms and conditions. Okay, exciting stuff. Go ahead and sign in with Google. Cool. Do you want to sign in with which account? If you have multiples, it will ask you to sign into multiples. I'm just going to sign in with my account here to sign into uh, TubeBuddy. And now I can do all kinds of things from inside of here. I can manage all of my YouTube stuff. Uh, one of the things I think is really helpful is to be able to start with canned responses to be able to uh, reply to somebody in YouTube and you know I mean you find that you end up using a lot of the same kinds of responses right so uh, just a general thank you thanks very much for watching and commenting I'm glad this was helpful for you because often people will say, oh, this was so helpful. I'm so glad that you helped me do whatever, right, with the videos that I've posted to YouTube. All right, so we'll go ahead and save that. Um, or I can go ahead and add another canned response and say, uh, can, a question mark. And often if somebody just is being a total troll uh, on YouTube comments in something I've posted and they're just like, this is the stupidest thing ever, man. You're stupid. You're lame. Why'd you post this? I can't believe you'd effing do this. Or, you know, whatever. Um, I'll often comment to them. What do you mean? Tell me more. <laughs> right? Uh, very often the trolls will just go away when you post something like this. But as part of YouTube's algorithm, you want to make sure that you're responding to all comments that come into your channel. And so this gives but either you know responding to them or deleting or removing them if they're total spam comments, marking them as spam, etc. So um, yeah, I mean, and they even have placeholders in here for you. So a placeholder is like if you want to say at you know. Um, Hey, at Total Jerk, uh, whatever their YouTube channel name is, um, what do you mean? Tell me more, right? You could put that in there as part of your canned response. And then it will, in my case, you know, my YouTube channel is Strive for Impact. And so it would put Strive for Impact, what do you mean? Tell me more, right? So this is just a, a time saving tool. Oh, okay. Uh, in the free account, which I'm showing you right now, I can only add one canned response. But in the paid account, if you upgrade to a paid account, which is probably a good thing to do if you're doing a lot of YouTube activity. Um, I would say, you know, uh, it could be very helpful for you to have multiple canned responses. So this is just one of the many things offered inside of TubeBuddy. Um, I can also connect multiple channels and I do have multiple YouTube channels. Um, but one of the things I like best actually is data insights. So you can go in here and see how your channel is actually working. Uh, on this account, I don't have it uh, because these are all free accounts. Um, let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Okay, cool. Um, keywords to track, ranking exposure. All right. Well, basically, um, to get access to the really cool stuff inside of TubeBuddy, you're going to have to upgrade your license. Um, so I can walk you through that as well uh, in a separate video. But one of the cool things you might try in here, if you're just on the free account, is to go in and watch their tips and tricks videos. They have all kinds of useful stuff to show you how you would um, do all kinds of useful things on your YouTube channel, right? I mean, just really helpful content, five reasons your videos aren't getting views, uh, secrets about creating thumbnails. Thumbnails are amazing uh, in what they can do to increase or decrease traffic to your videos. We had a client that we worked with actually 
I don't know, it's years ago, 2015, and we changed out all of their videos for custom ones that we built, and they kind of actually looked like this, but they didn't, um, they just had a like a preview screen of what was in the video, and it was just a little box that was in here like this, but we changed out only the little box, we didn't change out the whole screen, and their views actually went down on their videos, and we could measure it because we had changed, we, we were doing A-B testing on it, um, and yeah, um, Gosh, there's so much to cover here, but one of the cool things you could do inside of TubeBuddy is actually do A-B testing as well. So, uh, But even if all you do is sign up for a free account and just watch through a bunch of these. Um, how to embed a YouTube video for free on your website to earn more views. Okay, nice and easy, right? Um, how to share and track your YouTube videos. And this just gives you a way to track how often they're being shared. Um, there's just some really good, helpful tips inside of the TubeBuddy YouTube channel. And so um, definitely recommend you know, checking this out and trying it uh, as well. I'm signed in. I'm not going to sign into this account actually because uh, I want to keep it connected up to my other account. But if you're just signing up as a free user, um, at least start with canned responses and at least go into your uh, go into here and just look at the, t the tips and tricks. Just start there uh, and you'll start to see like what kind of useful content they put out and can offer you as far as just improving your YouTube channel overall even if you never buy anything from TubeBuddy. TubeBuddy. So definitely recommend that. Uh, I would check it out and hopefully this is helpful for you in seeing what to do with TubeBuddy. And if you have any questions, feel free to post in the comments. I promise I will respond to you if you're asking about TubeBuddy with more than a canned response. All right. Hope you're having a great day.